Hello, everybody, and happy Tuesday. This is a pick a card reading for today, August 8th. Tuesday, you pick a card. It's your main energy, but I do pull them all together. And if you're born today, August 8th, I will do a reading for you next. You pick card number one. You have the Ten of Pentacles. This is uh, the highest financial card in the deck, which is nice. Um, this is abundant energy. This is money. Um, for some of you, I do feel there could be some talks about money and investments for the future. Um, some of you may be giving some kind of financial advice or someone may be also um, advising you, but there's some talk and counsel maybe around this too. Um, you know, just kind of, there could be a delay with some kind of um, mini, uh, like a settlement or investment or something showing up here too. So somebody, some of you are going to be meeting up with, or um, love is coming into your life, you're single, and this person is very wealthy. That's another thing I picked up. Know that some delays are going to be in your favor today too, so I do pick up that energy. All right, card number three, uh, card number two is a major arcana of the chariot, so this is an important day for you. I do see no matter what, whatever happens today, victory, success is yours. Okay, it comes when you least expect it. It's definitely going to come through. This is great, exciting energy. Um, there's going to be a sudden breakthrough. I do feel that there could be um, some sudden change and a breakthrough, but it's going to um, bring you victory and success somehow. All right. I do feel you can manifest things too, so keep it very positive. I feel a breakthrough financial opportunity or something is coming through too. So I definitely feel that some great opportunities and some kind of maybe good news um, is coming through too. Okay, so that did show up. If um, And I do feel by, let's say, going into, give something by, I want to say October, there's going to be a big shift. And you this could be some plans for around that time for some reason. All right, um, card number three is the Ten of Swords. All right, so something is ending you're moving forward from it it's bittersweet and now i see sudden happiness so from some kind of difficult situation or something that you just didn't work out you're going to be very happy you need to stop beating yourself up over things there's something that you're kind of being hard on yourself just keep poofing but just leave it behind and i see support love and happiness around you Okay, don't regret things. Don't um, kind of uh, overthink things is what I'm feeling here. All right, so when I'm looking at all of this, this is a day to take our power back. This is a day of making some kind of decisions and trusting ourselves and moving forward. Travel plans are coming up, plans for the future. We need to relax a little. We need to kind of um, just take time for ourselves. There are some like negative energies here where, where we're thinking negatively, but we need, this is just fl uh, thoughts flooding. A little bit of chaotic energy around, but there is new beginnings. New beginnings are definitely coming through here too. I do feel that this is a day of a lot of opportunities. Yes, there's been some wishful thinking, so it's um, we, we need to reevaluate things through choices. And we're searching for a reason or a purpose today. Um, but I definitely feel that um, this is a day where things, um, we have a lot of options before us, so think and pick and choose wisely as well, okay? All right, um, that is the reading for today, Tuesday, um, August 8th. Have a fabulous, fabulous Tuesday. Happy birthday if you're born today, August 8th. This is a quick and general reading. This is your soul or your theme, and that is your wish card. And your soul or your theme is a major arcana of the empress. That means it's an important soul year for you. It's a major arcana. There is a focus on your mother, motherhood. Uh, a significant female is coming up. Is I do feel that for some of you, it really is a mother. Females are going to be very significant for you. You may be kind of like um, doing things behind the scene. Maybe you'll go into spirituality. You'll see a female guru um, or a female psychic. I don't know. I do feel that kind of energy. For some of you, you may go into a spiritual career. All right, so I do feel that this is also a year of peace, joy, and abundance, positivity with the home. Um, there could be news of expansion or pregnancy as well here. I do feel here your intuition is strongly indicated and some kind of knowledge you may get that other people don't know. And this could be esoteric energy too. So this is div um, connecting to your divine feminine. Um, this is um, also females, no matter what, whether you're male or ma uh, female, they're going to be... Um, significant trust yourself okay you're going to be highly sensitive to the vibes around you 
Um, this is a year of pure purification and high moral standards is what I'm picking up here too. Balancing your opposites and polar opposites, good versus evil too is what I'm picking up. Um, I do see that uh, perseverance is going to be important and there's some jealousy that does surround you. All right. So I do feel that energy. I do feel um, follow your intuition. OK, there is something like an emotional um, turmoil or a big wave coming up that's going to clear the way to watch your health um, this year, too. I do feel help is on its way that you need. Caution to slow down during the year, too. You could be dealing with a Pisces is coming up significantly during your year. You have some worries that you have and some fears, and you're going to overcome them, too. It is important to also take breaks during the year. Let things develop. Go with the flow, okay? An important child is coming into your life. All right. Could be a baby. All right. Your wish for your solar year is the Ace of Cups. Now, what I'm picking up here um, is give some, give some time for this wish to come through. Um have faith at will. Don't let anyone interfere is what I'm feeling here. There's a sense of interference. You have creative abilities to make this wish come through. This can come as a happy surprise too. For some of you, there is something that you're separating from and then something, a renewal of love is what I'm picking up here. Um, I do feel it's a more of a yes answer. Okay. Important numbers for your solar year. 2, 15, 27, 32, 66, and 17. I hope you have a wonderful birthday and a blessed solar year ahead and beyond. Everyone else, a wonderful Tuesday. Bye-bye for now.